Really? So, mas labing maayo. Okay, I'm a pure Chinese, but I really don't know how to speak well in Chinese because we don't practice that in the house. So, uh, that's a good thing. And katong gigan po ni Sir Romeo Ganihan na Chinese people are trained to become business people. Well, it depends on the family that you're in. Alright? So, for me, akong mama is a CPA. Actually, hindi siya CPA. Maka na graduate siya accounting. So, iyahang mindset sa kwa is still the same thing kung sa sa inyo ha. Which is, mag-squila ta para magkaroon o guwapo. Yun nga lang. Lahi na tata kung giliin Okay, so we have listened to Romeo and Bam about technically sa branding na part, di ba? And sa kuha na kaparta, na kong role is to share to you more about digital branding or digital marketing on how you can leverage your business through your brand. Okay lang sa inyo, Ana? Yes. Okay lang. But before anything else, since nagkakaman mo, tanawa na to kung naabay niyong attention. Okay? Sige lang. Everybody, raise your right hand. Kung nai buslo, tapo na lang. Okay, right, right hand as high as you can. Ayo, buslo na. All right, shake it as fast as you can. Shake it as fast as you can. Okay, ngayon, put your hand, put your right hand on your neck. All right, very good. So, may uban si hindi nani. This is not the neck. Okay? This is your forehead. So, this is the neck. Alright? At least we got your attention. And I know some people here, one of which is si Nyuhan President, si Panet. So, Pan, uh, Rose. <laughs> so, classmate maybe for sa DCHS, Dabo Christian High School. And I uban si Nyuhan din na nagmaster na din. Huwag ka pala nagmaster na din sila mga mga friends mo. Like Cherise, Jel, and Charlie. Alright, so special mention sa inyo. Okay? So ready ta? Ready ta ha? Hindi na gawin. Alright, hindi na gawin. Sige. So the topic for today I'm going to teach you guys is more about this. Make your mark. And that's my goal to you guys because we have been doing the present since February 2, 2018. So if you haven't seen our videos, maybe nakita lang ninyo siya, pero talimot lang ta. And pakita lang sa inyo. Ang expectations lang na ako yung request, okay lang mag-request? Yes. There are three things. How many things? Three. Number one is this. Phones on silent mode. So we already did that. Number two is participate. There are times I'm going to ask you questions and there are times that I'm going to ask you to do something stupid or crazy. So let's just make it happen. Is that okay? Yes. Okay. Number three is later after this session, there's going to be a QA. and a This is the open forum part. That means we are expecting you guys to ask many questions as you can. However, if I do not know the answer to the question, hindi ko magpatugstugs na hawag ko ha? So, mamahingan ko sa'yo, bye. <laughs> but if we do know the answer to the question, we will tell you honestly. Okay. This is my face when I was still 10 years old. Okay, so medyo ngit So that was me for 10 years old. And Dinoto, we started a business before with my brother. It's about cell phone accessories. And ang most pa lang na ato na time is Victoria Plaza in Gaysano Mall or GS Gaysano. Bawa pa lang na sila. Wala pang abriza, SM Lanang, SM Nicolang, wala pa lang sila. So we were doing well, however, because of competition. Familiar mo Chinatown? Yes. Familiar mo DCLA? Yes. Familiar mo Uyang Gurin? Yes. Oh, di ba barato? Yes. Yung mga piki? <laughs> <laughs> so because of that, what happened is our business nag shut down siya. So the good thing is, na exposed ako sa business world at the age of 10. Kung sa'yo masabot na ko na, pag akong kuya na asa Manila, ako nagsuri-suri ko din sa mga customers, mga yung orders nila. Mga na kong nagway. Okay, sa oran panahon. And then I got myself into network marketing. So, at the age of 16, uh, while I was doing here, I, I studied actually accounting for first year. And that was one of the decisions that I regret na ko. <laughs> because, well, wow, I mean, I'm math lang, akong prelim, nabinta akong score. Ano ba, dapat kayo? Nabinta, lahit naman yung karoon, letter grading naman, di ba? So, sa una is 90. Pag abot o midterm, 75. <laughs> Because of adjustment entries, so uh, Because of the adjustment entries, wow, what tanga mo Okay, pag about all kuan, pag about all sa finals, so kaluyan siyono 82 ako ang WPA at that time. 
Atene was very strict in terms of WPA's account accounting students. So, umabot dapat 85. So, na forced to shift ko to marketing. Diba? Dito lagi yun ni child. Anyway, so this is me. Kaila money? Chinkitan? So, Chinkitan actually is my cousin in Manila. Binong lang. Binong lang, binong lang. And now, napalian mo Chinese. So he produces content online about finances, about business, right? So you know that. Okay. One of the things that I really value in my life is friendship. So when it comes to friendship, like if like like a group bitaw, na friends yun ni mo mo na mungkin na sulit sa mo pansi yun dey pare pare lang mga tanguay, no? And na ako dera si familia mo ni Dabo Konyo. So this is Dabo Konyo, na. And as of this moment, happy na siya magka 500,000 followers. Wow. Very good, very good. Alright. One of, and most important thing is this. Uh, I'm in a relationship since high school. So nine years. Nine years na may. si Ads. No? So she's here. Everybody say, hi Ads! Hi Ads! <laughs> we have been together for nine years. And turning 10 this coming August 27. Happy to make the Alright? At least I'm way in Hibal and about the history. By the way, kalimot ko sa po ang mention sa kong name. Ako day si Jan. Everybody say hi, Jan. Hi, Jan. Sa college or sa high school, ang tawag sa po ang is Wenz. Okay, ako po name is Jan Wenzel Ocampoman. So, Wenz ang tawag sa po ato high school and college. Pero Jan ang nahibawan sa mga tawag. Alright. Another thing is I'm currently doing sales and operations for almost two years now in an importation industry. So technically, kana bitang mga feeds, raw mats, sa pagkahon sa manok o sa baboy, mao na mong ginabalig niya. Mao na mong ginabalig niya. So sales, ako na, and then operations. I'm handling a 1.1 hectare compound and puro na dito ang mga warehouse, technically. I cannot show the pictures really as much as I would want to, kaya dili daw pwede. So wak pa'y mahimo. Okay? And I'm also the founder and the content creator of this brand. Not sure if you're familiar with this brand. It's called The Present. And it started in February 2, 2018. Okay? And there is one goal or one reason why we started this brand, which is to inspire people to live a meaningful life. That's the goal. So it's really more about the, th there are three things that we are sharing. How many things? Three. First one is business, all right? Number two is finance, and number three is life. Most of the things that we are sharing through that brand is coming from my experience and from my from others' experience. I do not read from the book and just create a book report and then show it to you guys. Didi na siya in ang style. Okay, so we have to do it first, practice what we are saying in order for us to really share to you guys that whatever we are sharing is true or not. Get this? All right. Here are some of our videos. The very first video na nag-viral is kani. Nga nung pobre man gihapon ko. Abot lang kita ba ninyo na? Depende, siguro dili mo ka-relate. Kidatok mo mo ka no? So the very first video that went viral in our case is Nga nung pobre man gihapon ko. This video reached as of this moment is kana 3.8 million but as of this moment it's 4 million views. Okay? So all around the world, 4 million views siya. At the same time, there's one thing, sales versus operations. It's a 40 second clip that I mentioned that the challenges that arise between sales and operations. Pag naanap mo sa kanang kanabit ang real dyan na sales and operations, kasagaran maglalis dyan ang sales and operations. Yan naman. Kaya ang sales, sige promise sa customer, o niya wala din ay stop ang operations. Diba? Napi-usahay ng accounting that had made accounts payable because that had stuck sa bodega. So ang accounting, i-push ang sales para magbaligya. Pag humanan o baligya, kailangan man o connection. Sinan so, din ng mga things. That's the real things that you're going to experience when you do it. Mona, kung na-mention niya. And kami ang nagpinaka-viral na mga video, bayari yung utang. That post reached 5 million views. Right? 5 million views. And then, napi kung saan pagbalibad sa mga utang nimo and kani. 
recently na nag-viral three principles of investing. Familiar mo atong Facebook live balita no? Pero sige. <laughs> Familiar mo atong ka para regen marketing ang mamiko organiko and those things? Yes. Yes. Mo na siya kapaw. <laughs> Alright? So three principles of investing. So technically, what are the things that we have to consider when we invest in any platform? It may be insurance, it may be VUL, it may be mutual fund, it may be stock market, forex, or whatever. These things are things that we need to understand in terms of finance. So we are actually educating people about these things. That's what we do in the present. Do you get this? All right. So when Tonet no, approached me, or he nag message ya, and technically, ang among ish, he talked about is kanin. Build your trademark through branding. And it's a very good topic because we have been doing this for almost two years now. So we, we are really excited to share this guy. And ito muna tanong ko sa'yo, what brands do you buy? Sige you know? What brands do you buy? Can anyone answer? Okay, like itong mga tao doon nakailan ako ba? Jell. <laughs> Jel, ano sabi mga brands yung ginapalit mo? Ginapalit mo na ka ng... Masa ginapalit mo siya? Yes. Uh, Pandora. Pandora. Wow. Pandora. Okay. Napilain? Uniqlo. Uniqlo. Oh, okay. Welcome to Uniqlo. Kung ano gilig ko nito? Pag matukad siya pa. Welcome to Uniqlo. Alright. Sige. Next. Chart. Ano sabi yung ginapalit mo na kung ano chart? Na... Nike, all right. Ikaw, Chan, what's your name, Chan? What am I using the brand? Okay, okay. Important, Tonet, what's your name, what's your name, brand? LV, Rolex. <laughs> yeah, so, can you share? So, when you buy Pandora, Nike, the question is, why are you buying those things? Diba? Because Nike and Pandora and all these items, like for example, Louis Vuitton, Rolex, and things like that, are not cheap. Yes. In fact, you can even a copy. You can even buy a copycat as if same mangyahang leather or iyahang mga qualities. Pero ano dilit mang kamo palit nato? Because of the brand. I guess you know, that's the power of the brand. So in simple terms, this is how I understand what a brand is. So a brand is an entity that, that represents a set of values that people want to be associated with. I guess you know, So mas kina Ateneo, gamit ang Ateneo ba? Na amang we believe, or na amang we say ng Ateneo, no? and then this is some coming from Sir Ricky Enriquez. Kailan mo sorry kasi kasi? De ba? Sa teacher na to. <laughs> so de ba? We have this thinking mangod na kana bitong pagpasa o resume sa mga establishments mas lamang ang ateneo kaysa other schools. Mo nang de ba na anak dre? Or sa ako ang panahon nito kina niyo. Afrika bon pa na dre sa niyo? Afrika bon pa. All right. So kana mangod ang mga butang, na kana ang mga butang. This is also one of the reasons why parents are finding ways to spend for your tuition mas kinamahal dere sa Ateneo because of that association with the brand. Mas naasilig na tawag na security because of what we believe what the brand is. Now, not every establishment is doing that. Kung abot sa reality ba, hindi man yung una, pag abot sa resume, Ateneo, dere tanga. Ang uban na schools din lang. No, hindi ko na inana. Na may uban establishments na halo. In fact, most of them wala na kayo nagtatanong resume. But still, we have that belief. That is why our parents, since kasagaan sila, sila may nagbabayad ato sa atuwa dere, sila mo na ilang belief, mo na ganahan sila na direta. Kaya naatay ginatawag na edge. Pag-abot sa inanang tanga. Sa real world. Nag-gets yun eh? Okay? One of the guys that I really admire in terms of branding is this guy. So maybe you've seen him before. His name is Simon Sinek. Everybody say Simon Sinek. Simon Sinek. I've been out before Simon Sinek. 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 I don't know how to pronounce it. So 
Yeah, he is an author of a book called Start With Why. And that, that napocheck TED Talk, is one of the most viral top three videos na pag-abot sa TED Talk mo, siya na guy. And his concept about the golden circle, this is the golden circle, is applicable in terms of how we create the brand. Again, applicable siya on how we create the brand. Ang meaning ani, kinsa ba nakakita ani before? Or kinsa kanon na nakakita ani? Kinsa kinsa wala ay labo kung nakita. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so why, how, and what? The common thing that companies do in terms of those companies who do not believe what the power of branding is, is they communicate from the in, from the outside in. For example, and what namo is we are, for example, Cargill. Familiar mo Cargill, diba? Cargill. How? Amo is a gabaligya mi barato na feeds. Why? Why do we exist? Because we are cheap. We are very... I guess it's But when it comes to, in terms of branding, how we should communicate is from the inside out. Papansin nyo, katong pagsugod na to, ang amuang goal, in terms of how we created the brand, is to inspire people to live a meaningful life. So, money siya, ang why, and then how, and then what. Our style or our way of understanding this is this, in terms of our brand, okay? So why is to inspire people to live a meaningful life? How we are doing that, how we are showing that, that we are, can improve ba? That you know what you this morning you know what So YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook, we are posting twice or like two videos a week about education. Nano education man because kani inod bang god kitang tanan one of the word meaningful life pa lahi lahi mo tag gusto na ay ba siya gusto lalaki ay ba niya gusto og babae of course di ba ang anak okay may ba siya gusto og Mercedes Benz may ba siya gusto og Wigo may ba siya gusto og social na restaurant May upang sinyo ganahan o oh, JFC dila sa atbang. Depende, di ba? But at the end of the day, what what kind of meaning do you see yourself in your life pa? And usually, mo na siya yung brand. Kung unsa ang ginapalit ni mo siya sarili, that's actually who you are. I guess yun eh. If you have expensive things for yourself and in the house, mo na ang panahon sa tao siya mo, oh, wow. So, tot yan. Tot yan, ganun. Pero kung ikaw, maski na pareha ng edigong ba? Si Digong Presidente. But every time we see him eating in the karinderia, ang makarinig siya akin sa mat, ang masa. Nag-guess niyo? But he is not showing off. That's just who he is. Nag-guess niyo, eh? So it's, a, it's the brand, it's who you are as a person. And then, the what is the name of the company, which is the present. Okay? Now, what is that share sa inyo, ha? Principles of building a brand. Again, another they have building a brand. When you when you create a brand, regardless of what that is, you need to have principles. Kung ingon ni Sir Romy, ganiyan na kailangan na sa kay knowledge. So this is the first step. The very first step that we need to understand is that be passionate and competent. Pasabot ani kita ay magpagawas ka o content. Everybody say content. Content, ladies and gentlemen, is everything that you put out in the internet. Again, content is everything that you put out in the internet. Kung nag-post ka o IG story or Facebook story, content ang tawag ana. Kung nag-post ka o video na nahubog ang imuang kauban, content ang tawag ana. Kung nag-post ka video na natulog ang imuang kauban, ay nag-post ka picture na natulog ang imuang kauban, content ang tawag ana. Kung nag-run ka sa Facebook kung astang taasa, kinakikalagod sa yung maistra, content ang tawag ka na. Nag-gets? Nag so everything that we are putting out there, website, social media, Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, Snapchat, LinkedIn, and all those things, is content. Everybody say, content. Content. Ano pag-una pag-pronounce? 
no? sa to ni content. Sila is content. Ano na sila? Okay? So you have to be passionate and competent. Now, let's let's speak about uh, passionate first. Mahibala na nimo sa tao kung passionate siya or hindi. Asa man, kung saan man, based sa iyang energy. Based sa iyang energy kung ganahan mo siya. Na gets? In fact, some people are doing the things that they don't like but they have to tolerate it because that's what the society is expecting of them. Na gets niya ni? So na yung na, for example, kung negosyante ang imuhang parents, ang expectation sa imuha, kung saan man, mahimu ka? Negosyante. If you go against the grind, if you become an employee instead of being a business owner, mura ng expectations sa imuha, mura ng... Ni? Nga naman, ang imuha ang ginikanan ni Nani Man, blablabla. Diba? So, sa passion ng good, it's coming from who you are. Kasi mong hilig ba? Kung hilig ang basketball, then tinalak at how ka mag-story about basketball. Nana things. Kung hilig ang math, how ka math? Kung hilig ka o science, how ka science? Passion na siya. Yun nga lang, inani ang truth. It doesn't mean that you're passionate about something, you're good with that thing. Ayaw ba sa inyo na ayaw ba sa ito na gusto tag basketball? How uh, ka nang passionate atong basketball? Kung hindi dito ka balong dula o basketball. Diba? Mga nangyong nila, diba? Math, I love math. But math does not love me. Diba? It's the same thing sa ako. I love accounting unta. But accounting does not love me. Especially during the midterms. Okay? So, mami siya ang passionate and competent. Kailangan, ganahan kasi mong ginabuhat because when people see you online, ma-feel na nila kung dili ka ganahan sa mong ginainom. Or dili ka ganahan sa mong ginabuhat. At the same time, you need to have expertise, which is the competence part. When you see it both, when you have passion and competence, when you know that, that's what you call your sweet spot. Okay? Kasi dahil ang nakabot sa inyo. Laruhon lang natin na ha? Laruhon lang natin na ha? So that's what you call the sweet spot. So for example, sa Mua, the case, it's three things. We are passionate about business, finance, and life-related content. We don't consider ourselves as experts, but we do know how to do those things. I guess? Alright, that's the first one. Okay? On sa ang first one? B and O na siyang first. Number two. Put out consistent content. Sabi ko, kami lang natatahan sa content. So you have to be consistent. Kung sa packaging ganiha, nagpapakita na yung mayo, dapat consistent ang imong packaging and all, and yung sa imong logo, yung sa imong slogan and all, it's the same thing when you apply it in the digital space. You have to be consistent. Alright? Murag salida, murag salida ba? Usually naatay salida, once a week. Except kung probinsano, once a day. Diba? Probinsano, once a day. Tapos sige lang zoom in. Zoom. Zoom. Zoom, 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 zoom. Ano na ang gawas? Kita kong probinsano? Mone lang branding. Sige lang zoom. Diba? Nahuma na lang tibuok. Kung sa? Part, bago na pilis, bago na commercial, puro lang zoom in, zoom out. Anton Ilong na limang ito. So you have to be consistent with your content. Alright? What that means is, if you promise to put out once a week, dapat na ako ipagawa sa content once a week. Again, hindi ka pwede basta-basta maputol. So one of the things that we do, Monisha, no? Maning part ang types of content. There are three types of content. How many? Three. Ang first one is kana. Long form content. Kana bitong mag-rant. <laughs> Di ba? Na yung ba si, siguro na guilty. Pag human yung post, pag ilike na sa itong tao, yun yung i-delete. <laughs> Kasabot, nabasa na. <laughs> so, mali siya ang example sa long form content. So, the good thing about this is ang one target market, ang katong mga market na hilig magbasa. Kung dili sila ganahan magbasa, ayaw expect na pindutunto nilang see more. 
Di ba naman ay Seymour? Yes. Okay, anak na siya. Alright? Of all types of content, money siya ang least effective. Effective siya, pero least effective. Sa tulog. Ang ikaduha, graphic. Everybody say, graphic. Graphic. Graphic, image, poster, mona siya, category, graphic. Sa ito pa, naa siya yung picture. Tanawal lang ni mong picture, masabta na ni mo ang ihampunto. Ganon. Diba? So kung naa kay, na kay picture na kita hay mong negosyo kay cake, so picture ni mong cake, pasabot, lamit ang imuhang cake. Pag-in na na. Kung naa kay picture na information, kaya sa ginagawa sa mga insurance companies, nasa rin itawag na VUM. Or kaya, life insurance. Kumuha ka na before ka mamatay. Ano na. That's graphic. Okay? Mauna yun lang inabalik yan. What insurance people are selling actually is your death. Dabi-dabi-dabi. Pinanglan. Pinanglan. Okay? For example, ano yun ay mga quote cards? That's image. The good thing is kita mga good tao, hilig tao ka ng visual. Hilig tag visual. To be honest with you guys, one of the talk, most of the talks that we did in the past, walay visual. Kasi gano'y na nila paminaw lang. Pero mapansin mo sa mga tao, ilang mga facial reaction mo yun, ano? Sa daw, sa daw? Ganyan na. So we need to have visual. Para, kaning visual is really for you. Para na sa inyo ka. Nag-gets? Para makita nyo. So one of the ikatuhan. Number three, which is the most effective, is video. Yan naman. Ang video mga good, it elicits a certain amount of trust. Na-ashay trust na mag-form ba? Imagine nyo, kung dili, nagkipag-chat ka sa isa katao, pero wala, kung kakaila ko, sa iyahang dagway, sa iyahang tingog, sa iyahang tanan. Di ba medyo weird ang feeling? This is why personal interaction is very important. It's the same thing with video. That's what you experience in video. You build the trust. Kabalo ka kung kinsa ng tawhana na. Of all the types of content, this is the most effective. So, least effective ang unsa? Long form. Ang graphic, okay. Number three is video. Money siya ang pinaka-effective. In fact, you can also earn money through that. Kailan mo ni Nas Daily? Nas Daily, di ba na na siya yung videos? Di ba? Wapo kayo na siya magpawa ng videos? Ay makabot yun na siya yung 11 million views, 20 million views, inaakataghan? Try to imagine kung graphics ko siya tanan. Less. So through video siya nag-a-lambot. Alright? And in terms of consistent content, somewhat is twice a week. Now, it doesn't have to be twice a week. Usually, it's once a week. Imagine you are a teleserye. Kintahe, mag-ibot na kag-brand for your business or para sa iyong sarili, dapat na aking ipagawas at least man lang once a week. So sa mua, money siya, ang proof na mo. So every week, nagpagawas niyo two videos every week. That's Wednesday, 7 p.m. and Sunday, 7 p.m. So sometimes we also do Facebook Lives. Alright? Kung mag-Facebook Live niyo na yung mga 500 people na mo, mo join immediately. Alright? Say it. Auto siya number two. Number three, don't rely on a single platform. Pila ka platform? Isa. Pila ka platform? Single. Isa. Don't rely on a single platform. Why? Here's the truth. The Facebook algorithm ba? The Facebook algorithm. Familiar mo na ang word na algorithm? Money siya ang aling mga back-end, ang mga code-code, no? Madili na ito makita. Ang Facebook na algorithm will always change. It's the same thing with Instagram. It's the same. It's the same thing with YouTube. Try to imagine sa una ang YouTube. Walak na siya stories. Kabalo ba mo kano na siya stories? Na siya stories. Ang Instagram sa una walak na siya video. Unsa mo na siya tanan? Photos. Walak na yung nato na in IG worthy na picture, di ba naman yung nana? Kung bati ganyan na yung picture, ayaw na ibutang sa IG. Okay, bati na. Okay? So, muna siya, IG worthy. Kano na ano siya? Videos. In fact, na siya IG TV. Ang Facebook sa una, walay stories. Kano na ano siya? Stories. So, sa may punto ani? Sige, change ang platform. Kung magsalig lang ka sa isa, kung mahugno ng isa, kung sa'yo mahita po? 
hugno kal kapil. So you have to diversify. And here's the good thing. In terms of social media marketing, in terms of marketing in general, social media is the cheapest. Cheapest. Right? I also do, since I mentioned ko na sales person ko, kanabit ang marketing, mo biyahe ka, biyahe ko kapalong, biyahe ko bigos, biyahe ko bigos, kita ko sa customer, makipagsikat, ay man, kamusta? Chichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichichich
repeat. Kung naakay comment madawat, kung naakay message madawat, you have to read it. Di ba? Sa ato pa, scene zone. Na scene zone. Dapat basahon na to siya. Tapos, kung naakay ikasulti, magtubag ka. Tapos, repeat the process over time. Okay? I think this is the last one. Don't sacrifice your brand for money. This is the ve- this is one of the most difficult parts, especially kung nagkuk na kana brand, and especially kung in fact mas kinagamay mong brand na ay gusto mong buy out si mo ha. Ano man kaya nasa si mo ning, kaya nasa si mo hangi na buhat, so gusto nila i buy out nila ang brand para ang imo hangi hago for how many months and years? Paliton lang nila with the power of money. Okay, tagal tama example. Kailan mo na? Si Catrio uh, Catrio na Gray? Oh, ah? Silver Lightning Silver Lightning Okay, so inanin niya siya Na yung nag-invite sa um, ako ah no? Taga Tabakan Kami na mga sa Tabakan? Sa Tonton Mok Digos Dili na mao Muna ba? <laughs> so na yung kinapawan Dili niya ko na mao Muna ba? Mga 30 minutes Okay? So, na yung nag-invite sa, uh, sa kabakan, na ano sila yung beauty pageant. Sir, meron kami beauty pageant. So, ganito po yung gawin namin. Ipa-courtesy call ka namin sa mayor. Ganyan. Tapos pagdating mo dito, lahat, hotel accommodation mo, served. Served. <laughs> anyway, so na yung nag-invite sa mga, to be the judge. Try to imagine ako mag-judge ako beauty pageant. Kung saan ako man ako na? Diba? Well, ito yung ang setting point, okay? Pag mag-judge daw po. Nga no ko niya gusto may mong judge is because ang mayor daw dito nakakita sa kong video, ang katong mga tao dito na iyahang kadu business with nakita sa mong video. So gusto nila, ako ang may mong judge dito sa ilang beauty pageant. On August, twi- August 16. August 16, wala pa. Okay, August 16. So they are willing to pay me 15,000 pesos for that event. Kinsi mil. So bato na ko. So up, kinsi mil, na pa hotel accommodation, tapos uh, courtesy call with the mayor, pagkaman mo, lakaw. Oh, wow. Yeah, why not? So I declined ako siya. I did not accept it. Why? Because it's not part of the brand. Because kung mag-judge ko dito, definitely they're, they're going to use the brand. And again, ang punto ang, ang samua is tulog ako. Business, finance, and life. Walay nakabutang liha na beauty pageant. <laughs> Nag-gets niyo ni? So, lami ang kwarta. 15 mil. Isa ka adlaw. Lami din eh. Depende kung dato mo, subi mo ganahan. <laughs> diba? Pero kung ka ng average person, or okay lang mo. Maganahan mo. See? So, kiniklaya na mo siya. Mas kinala sakit. Another thing is kanin ka nagkatawan, nagkatawan dito ko na story. Kinsa ka na ang milk tea? Milk tea! Wala ka na ang milk tea rin? Milk tea ba? Wala! Wala ka rin. Cha time, gong cha, makaw imperial, ano saan ba? And ser- serenity, infinity, and all kinds of tea. You know, things like that. So, na yung isa ka bag-o, bag-o na milk tea siya. Okay? So, i-duol siya sa kuha. Duol siya sa kuha na siya na. I-promote daw na ko siya. So, this is one of the ways that you can monetize your brand. Okay? This is one of the ways. But depende against him. So, i-promote daw na ko siya, tapos bayaran na ko niya. Okay? Ano ko? Okay. Kung saan mo rin ang imagination, kung saan mo expectations sa pag-promote na mo sa brand. Yan ang ito. Okay, dahil. Okay. Imagine nyo, diba? Milk tea, diba? Nakakuha na ng straw. Akong baton daw, mana po. Lami, ahoy! <laughs> Unya, naa sa video. Unya, pag humanda ko ito, akong i-post. Kato ang nakabala. Lami, mm, ahoy! Ano daw? Wala. Ako. <laughs> Dili. <laughs> Dili pwede. Dili may nana. Again, why? Because the people na nagatan ako sa the present, dili kay mo tanaw sa kuha, hmm, nami ha, uy, dili. They are going there to get educated. Nuggets? 
sa tato lang. <laughs> no? So, kasi nitabo na balibaran. But again, nag-hapo kay mga collaborations o mga brand deals na nitabo. Right? So, na mga forex, mga workshop, nakipag-partner sa mga, so, ni-attend sa me bago na mong market na mga speaking engagements just like this to educate people about branding, business, finance, and things like that. So, na ako yung mga good side. Pero I'm just sharing to you na never ever sacrifice your brand for money. Mo na importante, dapat kasabot ka unsa ang rason nga no ni mo gibugo ang imuhang brand. Kung gili gani, gamay lang anak sa imuha, pagdali sa imuha, pa! Huwag tanda yun. Iprenda yung mong yuta, iprenda yung mong karabaw para i-invest. Ay, lahat ko siya. <laughs> lahat ko siya. Okay, next. Okay, And the last one. This is a marathon, not a sprint. Kasi pasamutan ni, it doesn't mean when you create a brand, automatic, karoon zero yung followers, umak na kay 500,000. Pilit na siya yung In fact, your followers doesn't even automatically mean na gwapo ang imuhang brand. Na isa ka buong tao ba? Model siya. No? Na siya 2.7 million followers. Naghan ang bilin. Naghan. So since na siya 2.7 million followers, na, na ay isa ka buong brand na ipag-partner siya, magbalig yun siyang merch, merchandise, t-shirt, na iyahang brand. Tag na, pinaka buong tao ni palit. Sa 2.7 million. Wala ni abot o 30. So 2.7 million, less than 30 lang ni palit. Weird, no? So na naman, because ang nahulong mga ito, iyahang brand mga good is really more about picture tapos ipakita na sa mga tao na sexy-sexy man. So people follow her not because of the value that she's giving, kundi because he's sexy siya. Sakit, no? Parang ginamit ka lang. No? Do you not understand? Tanggal ito, tanggal ito, tanggal ito. Okay. This is a marathon, not a sprint. When we started the present, we started with zero. First month na mo, na may 30 ka po. Kinsa ng 30, mga friends. You see, invite friends to like this page. Okay, we invite ang tanan. Sa daghani mong friends sa Facebook, trying ta lang ang nag-like ito. Or a networking, invite, invite, invite. Nga, why not join? Ginanawa. So 30 ka buo, and as of this moment, na kami 176,288 followers sa mga na sa page. Okay? So what they're getting out of us is the content. Kanang pinapagawas na mo. Now, if we stop, right? Imagine, no? Ang graph. Sa October, dara pa siya ni Saka. Pugtaman naman. Ganun niya siya. Kanang October, dara ang ipagawas tong video na nga nung problem ang gihapon ko. Oh, ba dyan? Yes, because that was the first viral and bisaya na video. From February to the rest of October, English kanan. So, ni-adjust ko sa market. Kinsa nag-suggest sa kuha mag-bisaya ko? Si Davao Ponyo. So, nakita me, nag-collab me, nag-mention sa kuha na mag-try daw kong bisaya. So, dito po na siya ng mga tao, di ka pero daw mag-bisaya, pero itsi kong dagway. Ano, dosintos, disintos, kamada, ano, gitaw ng mga things. Because since naalagi mi warehouse, akong kastorya ang mga labor. Kanya, ah, mga labor, mga so, boss, pila may kargaan ng truck? Alam ko, 400. Ah, 400. Kung saan ng 400? 400, boss! Ah, okay. So, inana ba? Makatuon ka because of that. Okay? Sige, muna siya. Sa practice na part, at ang man, leverage your brand for your business. Pasabot ani, if you have a brand online, you can actually make your business grow faster. For example, kani, do you know this guy? Siguro dili siya si Kapi sinyo, but he's one of the reasons nga nung start yun ako on the present. His name is Gary Vaynerchuk. So he owns a media company in the United States worth $200 million. Okay? And before that, he runs a business for his family, na winery. So yang ibuhat, gimaximize niya ang YouTube in 2006 through this. Wine library. Ang iya ang ginabuhat lang is nagataste siya of wine in front of the camera and giving his honest opinion about what he thinks about the wine. So kung feeling niya luod ang wine, ino lang niya da, inaning lasa, inaning lasa, inaning lasa. So because of that video, because of what he is doing, daghan mga customers nakabalo kung unsay gusto nila itry dito sa iyang shop. 
See? That's one way. So, gigamit ni ang YouTube for marketing reasons. Alright? Ang iyahang kailangan lang is flip cam. Camera. So, can you sure ko nakita ng money na video? And everybody is familiar with this? Familiar mo na? It's a deal it familiar. video, money siya sa Jollibee. Okay? So, kanil sa Jollibee, kato siya na video, ang punto lang nato is, if you, did, if you notice, they did not sell Jollibee. Wala sila yung una. For 79 pesos only, you can get one cup of rice and one drumstick and for with french fries and coke. Wala sila yung una na. What they are sharing is the story. Which is katong yung sermon yung ganiha. When you have a brand, you need to relay a story. That's what they did. In fact, because of that, daghan kayo naka relate, no? Even kita, daghan kita nag-comment. Di guwapo ang ilahang brand awareness, and then taas ko nilang sales katong na quarter. I guess yun eh? So, sometimes ako kita, sige tako na muna, baligya, 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 baligya. Dili ganahan ang tao baligyaan. Nobody wants to be sold. English Okay? ka Alright. So speaking engagements. So the good thing is because of the brand that we are doing, Morisha ang uh, impact na po sa society. So we have been invited by different companies and establishments and institutions. No? Uh, latest one that we had was with NCCC Davao and NCCC Tagum because most of the employees that they had got affected sa kanyang mga investment schemes. Most of the government companies, by the way, the impact put sila and they cannot resign because of that. No? Hoping, kung ato kang tagong sa una ba, walay pedikap o walay labor sa ilang tulay. Tama. 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 <laughs> Tinood na siya. Karoon namalit na. Ano naman? Tuwag tang naman. I guess? Okay. Challenge that I have for you is this. So, they can't go learn. Alright. So challenge that I have for you is this. Action plan. Number one, choose a platform. So mo siya ang call to action. Pasabot ani, kung ganahan mo Facebook, Facebook. Kung ganahan mo YouTube, YouTube. Kung ganahan mo Instagram, Instagram. Just start. Total, kung magpagawas ka video, wala may makikita. Wala pa makay followers sa sumpo. So dyan, naina ni Moe, sakit pa kayo kamanuti. Actually, advantage na siya. Nga naman, dili ka maghuna-huna kung unsa yun ako nahuna akong simuha. Masyak na sila. Uy, sikat na lagi ka. Okay? So choose a platform. Number two, create content. Kung say content, di ba tulog ka po? Long form, graphic, or video. Depende sa inyo ha kung asa mo comfortable. I started with long form content. Taas kig sulat, huwag may basa. Yung naman, wala pa may followers. So ano siya. Number three, post relevant content at least once a week. Ang ganahan na po in number three is you're creating a habit. Okay? Number four, respond to comments. Wisi, kung malay comment, wala kayo ka respond. Okay? So, respond to comments, likes, and messages. And number five, grow your page and account to 5,000 followers. You don't have to create something na bag po. It can be your personal account. Di ba? Kung sikat ka na tao, 5,000 followers, dali na kayo na. Okay? So, that's the action plan. So, thank you very much. For your time. Thank you very much. Now this time, we are going to open the floor for the Q&A. So ayun ka ulaw na. And I would like to ask our speakers. We are just going to get the chair in front. Can you, can you help me? Two chairs in front. Because ayun ka ulaw ba, you really be honest with your questions. And it may be in line with your job or if you have a side hustle or if you have your own business. So really grab the opportunity while our practitioners are here right in front of us.
Okay, so uh, my fellow officers would also be looking around. Just raise your hand if you want you if you want to be called. Okay, say any volunteer. Just read. I wasn't able to wear my glasses, so you just have to really raise your high, uh, your hand high. Okay, sapa. Oh, hello. Sige. Easy, easy. We have Wow Carmen Heart Handicrafts for those who will give uh, questions. So. Wow! Wow! Jo I didn't know what to do. Good afternoon. I'm Jeff from MPA. I would like to ask Karina, who is the first speaker, in Mr. Branding, uh, how could a business or entrepreneur you plan on making a brand his product or his product without compromising the, uh, the cost or the price of the item. Kanina kasi yung sa fruit juice from 20 pesos raise up to 50 pesos and the market is mostly itong mga simple tao lang especially patapos sa peanut, butter food kung saan niya pag-compete, mag-replant ko, buha ko tanawon pero ulo siya ibalik sa market Actually, our speaker has to go for a meeting, but like, let's take it in a general sense. How about, how would you take that? Jeff, no? So the question is, how do you want to compromise your costing or pricing in the market? Okay, that's it. When you adjust your price, when you uh, when you adjust your brand, expect that the price will also change. Like it's just a reality that we have to face, okay? Because what's gonna happen is that there's what we call a perceived value. So kung sa ang kanan yun sa mga ginali ba kita plato, kung plato palito ni mga department store most probably that's going to cost you a maximum of one hundred pesos. Plato na play. Kung ang plato butang tatakan ni mga Starbucks gusto hari ta kinsi na kwan na five hundred pesos na. Kung sa kanan no, it's a brand, okay? So expect when you repackage, there's going to be a change in the price in the marketplace. Why that also happens, besides the fact that I perceive value, most probably mas dako ng imuhang gasto for that repackaging. That's the, that's the thing, okay? So kung mas dako ang imuhang gasto, most probably kinahanglan po niyo adjust mong presyo. The challenge that you have to consider is your market. Because when you rebrand, your market can also follow immediately. This is why some companies, they create two brands. Okay? For example, ani kita um, na kay NCCC. Right? NCCC. Kung na kay NCCC na brand, tapos, kung sa may market sa NCCC, masa. Mapansin niyo sa NCCC yung yung rin, yung katong maa sa una, pati na sa una, ang iyahang design sa place, masa. In fact, the kaya ng mga tulito. The new one, which is kaya ng mga tulito ng mga NCCC, ang challenge nila sa NCCC buhangin is ang ilang aesthetics man good, medyo bangko, medyo social. So ang market, mas kina NCCC ang nagbutang, pero ang aesthetics mo lang dili lang ni NCCC, manibago sila. In fact, mas tigamay ang traffic from the mass market because of it. Okay? So this is what you have to consider lang dyan. How you're going to address that is you can create a separate entity instead. Okay, for example, kung naakay inang na brand, kung kanina brand is social, maghimukad lahi na brand, same ang holdings company per lahi ang iyahang marketplace. That's it. Okay? Unless, if you're willing to sacrifice or if you're willing to compromise na katong brand ni mo, na katong gusto niyo, for example, katong lamian, lamian to siya, lamian, or katong peanut butter, gusto din niya na ipa-up siya, para dilit na siya, dilit na siya pang masa niyang market, then that's a choice that you have to make as a business owner. Okay? So, mo lang siya kung ang point about it. Your take. 